Looking breathtaking in tiara, Kate handed special honor for first state banquet under King Charles. The Princess of Wales could be seen in her wedding tiara soon as she will attend her first state banquet when the President of South Africa visits the UK next week. King Charles III will host the first state visit of his reign next week when the President of South Africa pays the UK a visit. Kate Middleton and Prince William will both take a key role in greeting President Ramaphosa on behalf of the King on Tuesday, November 22nd. And William and Kate have been given the task of greeting the President at his London Hotel on behalf of the King on Tuesday morning, travel with him on Horse Guards Parade for the ceremonial welcome with Charles, and then join the carriage procession back to the palace. The prince and princess are expected to attend the white tie banquet on Tuesday evening with Kate and Queen Consort Camilla in tiaras. Both the king and the president will make speeches. The visit follows the traditional format adopted during the reign of the late queen. The royals are likely preparing for a tiara moment as King Charles III's first state visit as the monarch is set for next week. Kate is famously a fan of the pearl dropped Cambridge Lover's Knot Tiara, which was also a favorite of her late mother-in-law, Princess Diana. Though the new Princess of Wales has officially been a member of the royal family for over a decade, she's only worn the tiara a dozen times. Kate was glowing in the Cartier Halo Tiara on her 2011 wedding day to Prince William and twinkled in the Lotus Flower Tiara for two previous diplomatic evenings. Queen Camilla, 75, has a bit of a bolder taste in crowns with one clear favorite. The Queen Consort has sparkled in the Greville Tiara at least eight times since she married King Charles, defined by its distinctive honeycomb design. Camilla has similarly shimmered in the unmissable Delhi Durbar Tiara and Floral Cubit Tiara, which the court jeweler reports is a Shand family heirloom. A royal banquet at Buckingham Palace or Windsor Castle is a grand affair. Heads of state, Britain's aristocracy, and a whole host of important dignitaries have had the pleasure of dining with Her Majesty the Queen over the years. The Queen is a professional when it comes to hosting state visits. The monarch inspects the horseshoe-shaped table herself in the afternoon before the banquet, checking the preparations with the master of the household. Banquets take a long time to prepare for, six months in fact. It also takes palace staff three days to lay the table. The state banquet was the first for Kate since 2019 as they were put on hold due to the coronavirus pandemic. This means she will most certainly wear a tiara for the occasion as it's customary for royal women to do so. In 2014, William and Kate greeted the President of Singapore, Tony Tan Keng Yam, on behalf of the Queen and joined the Horse Guards Parade ceremonial welcome. But traditionally, it was usually a duty which fell to Charles as the then Prince of Wales. As the highest ranking royals following King Charles and Queen Camilla, Princess Kate and Prince William, will take a central role in helping host the first couple of South Africa during their visit. A warm welcome, I'm sure.